What's up, suckers? Well, tonight we cross the river sticks. We find everything hockey net related on our PC and we hit delete. Try again. <laughs> This is no longer located there. That's all right. We can skip for all the try agains. Hotkey net is now gone. Apparently, Blizzard doesn't want me key cloning and we need to obey Blizzard or they're going to make us stop playing their game. But in all seriousness, I am, um, <laughs> I am once again coming to you, this is a Bernie Sanders commercial, I am once again coming to you to talk about multiboxing being limited in some way. I do want to urge all of you who still think that you can pull this off, that you can't pull it off. It will work for a little while longer, and then someone will report you, and Blizzard will investigate, and you will be banned! And I have already had players contact me and say, now you can never verify this completely, but I've had players contact me and say that they were banned while soloing or while multiboxing without HotkeyNet running, but HotkeyNet was on their computer. And they were banned anyway, even though they were not running HotkeyNet. So, let me urge all of you, if you have HotkeyNet, it's not an installable app, mind you. You don't install HotkeyNet on your computer. But if you have it on your system, download this wonderful piece of code called everything, find everything. You can call it find everything. And just type into it HotkeyNet and delete everything, everything from your system. After that, you can multibox. And maybe do it safely. I'm not so sure about that. Because I don't know that Blizzard really cares whether you're using key cloning or not. I think if you act in a way that makes it look like you're key cloning or makes it look like you're multiboxing, I think that you can be banned anyway. And I think those bans will stick. And I based this on contacts from multiboxers around the internet, uh, posting on my videos or posting on the Discord and letting me know, hey, Fury Swaps, buddy, Fury swaps. You gotta save me. Guys, I cannot say, I can't even say myself. All right, I got fired last week. And I can't even save myself. How am I gonna save you? Now I did get another job. Thank you very much, Lord in heaven. But, you know, Blizzard is gonna do what Blizzard does. And what Blizzard does is they mess with your head. This is going to mess with you. And so, yeah, you got to play by their rules if you're going to play in the retail world or the classic world. Now, you can always go to a private server and play by somebody else's rules. Yeah, somebody else's rules will probably be much more multi-boxing friendly, multi friendly, or maybe they won't. But 
You will always be playing by somebody else's rules. Unless you make your own server. Then you play by your own rules. But here's why that doesn't work for me. If I'm playing on my own server and playing by my own rules, which will always favor me, what am I winning? I'm winning a race that I started myself, that I set the rules for, that only a very small, tiny, infinitesimal number of people will come play in. So, I don't want to win that race. I want to win a different race. I want to win a race where people are there. And that race is retail. That race is classic. So, all I'm saying, guys, is starting today, delete your hotkey net. Delete your... IS Boxer. Don't have it on there. Delete your auto hotkey. Get rid of it. We will find a way to get you multi boxing again. All right. We already have many people on my Discord coming up with very cool methods of popping your windows, for example, using Windows PowerShell or using other very, very uh, low profile apps that are not on the radar of um, of Blizzard. So anyway, I really don't know where I'm going with this, but I, I do know that you saw me delete my hotkey net tonight, and maybe I will be back on again later, um, actually, actually showing you how to multibox and showing you um, what to do in your new life. But um, that time is not now. Um, I want to send thanks out to everyone who supported me in the five-minute multiboxing effort. I don't think five-minute multiboxing is dead by any stretch. But I just, during this very busy time of my life of switching jobs, I just don't have enough energy or time to give it the um, the effort it deserves. And so, although I'm gonna find some time for it, um, I don't have that time right now because I'm going into a new phase of my life and I'm gonna have to put some effort into that phase. Um, but it's all going to be okay. Everything's going to be fine. And we're all going to join each other in 2021 when the year turns over and things are better. 2021 is going to be like Elysium. We will be riding along and we will be in a field of grass. And there will be no one around us. And we will look and we will realize it's 2020. And we're already saved. So thanks for joining me on this journey. And I will see you on the other side.